Hey everyone, so today is Friday. This is my VLCD45 and um, the hubby's VLCD26. So, um, last time I vlogged was a couple days ago was VLCD42. And um, I just kind of have to get you all cut up and let you know what's going on. Sorry I haven't vlogged in a few days. I mean, I've been super busy um, dealing with the kids, parent-teacher conference, and um, working. I've been working like crazy, so I just really have been really too tired to come on here and do a vlog. Um, but anyhow, let me get you all caught up on our stats. So, VLCD42, I believe I told you all I was up 0.8. VLCD43, I was down 0.8. VLCD44, I was up 0.2. <laughs> And VLCD 45, which is today, I was down a pound. So, um, yeah, I think my body was just fluctuating so much because of me working and not getting enough sleep. I wasn't getting all my water in. And on top of that, when I work, I tend to eat more. So, I feel like my body needs the extra calories. But maybe it doesn't need the extra calories. Maybe that's all in my head because my body clearly was not liking the extra calories. <laughs> It was not liking the extra protein I was eating. And so, um, yeah, my body did not like it. And it was not responding well on a scale or anything like that. And I don't know, it might have been my scale. It might have been a little off. So, I actually, I'm going to go buy a new one um, probably tomorrow or Sunday. I'm going to get a better one because I think I want one that, like, measures body fat and stuff like that. So, yeah, I might go get a better scale. Um, I'm kind of vlogging in my jacket, guys, because I'm cold. I've been cold the past couple days and it's like my feet are always cold and I just can't seem to warm up. So, anyhow, um, Hubby's VLCD26, I believe I told you last that he was up two pounds. Um, the two pounds was at 317.8. So today he weighed and he was down to 312.2. So, Hubby's down like freaking five pounds in five days because I think he weighed on Sunday so yeah pretty damn good um he's more mentally ready he's more mentally focused he has been doing so well on the protocol you all that he's he's doing amazing and he's drinking all his water um he also started uh walking a mile a day like he walks a mile or two a day just to help keep him focused on the protocol and I feel like you know if that's what he has to do to um to stay pop and to stay focused and not cheat, then by all means, do it. So, he's doing really good. And, um, yeah, he's just ready to rock this round out. And I am too. <laughs> okay, so, I wanted to tell you all that my mom actually asked me about the HCG protocol. And she wants to start. Isn't that awesome? So, um, I actually told her about it. Well, she knew... She She's known since round one what I've been doing. But yeah, um, she actually wants to start. And she um, actually did have, uh, what's she call it, surgery. She had the gastric bypass sleeve or the gastric sleeve surgery. Something like that. No, the sleeve. Okay, it's called the sleeve. But she had that surgery done last year. And um, she lost 70 pounds. Since then, she's um, gained 20 pounds back because even though she can't eat a lot, she still doesn't watch what she eats. Like, she'll eat chips or fried foods or fast food. Yes, chips <laughs> or fast foods. And um, she's not supposed to have it. So, she might not eat a lot of it. It's just the point she's eating it. She's not eating anything healthy. And she was exercising but stopped. So, she wants to do this protocol, and she asked me to order some HCG for her. I don't know if I want, to do, want her to do injections right away, only because I think you have to be a little bit more mentally prepared to before you do Rx injections. Um, just my opinion, and I don't think she's all the way there yet. Um, and I only say that because she asked me how strict was and I'm like well mom is so strict you can't really have anything she was like so if I eat like 15 potato chips <laughs> will that affect me I'm like yes I'm like you can't have 15 potato chips okay so that question alone when she asked me made me like I don't think she's ready for the injections hell yeah I don't know if I was ready for them when I first started them but um I'm doing much better this time so yeah 
So she wants to start and of course I told her read pounds and inches and I sent her the link for pounds and inches and all of that stuff. So I told her read that and then get back with me. You know, I, I love supporting people on this journey and I love helping out and I love answering questions and providing any type of support I can. Um, but I just want everybody to do your research first. And I told her to research it because she ain't done no research. I did a ton of research before I started it. So, yeah, I wanted her to research it and read pounds and inches and all of that other, all of that other stuff. So, um, she'll, I'll probably order it for her next week if she's read the book and she's serious about it. So, yeah, um, then hopefully she starts around and then I'll have two round buddies, my mom and my hubby. And that will be so awesome to be losing weight with her because she, she needs it for health reasons as well. Um, high blood pressure and just you know at risk for a heart attack and stroke and all of that stuff so I, i'd be thrilled if she did this and was serious and stuck to it and lost a ton of weight and um i told her i was like well i i told her i weigh every day and she's like oh i'm not gonna weigh every day i'm just gonna weigh once a week so and if she does this guys i will definitely come in here and vlog about it and tell you all how she's doing and all that other stuff but i am gonna get out of here oh one last thing before i forget Pray for me, you all, because I am going to the Cheesecake Factory with my girlfriend tomorrow, and I am terrified. <laughs> okay, I'm terrified because I looked on their menu. I think I had asked, was it last week, I believe, asked in a Facebook group, like, oh my God, what can I order? And, um, and I just... I looked at the menu and I'm still a little tossed up on what I'm going to get, but I did see some things that could, could work. Um, I didn't see nothing that was my, I mean, that was pop, but, um, maybe a grilled chicken salad. Maybe I'll have to tell them not X out this X out that X out that, <laughs> but that might be the good best thing I have to do because other than that, there's nothing on there. Oh my God. So I'm going to pray in the morning before I go that I am able to stick to protocol. Because I don't want to cheat. So yeah. But I'm going to get out of here. And I guess I will see you all. I'm going to try to do a vlog tomorrow. If not, I will see you all on Sunday and let you know my way in and how things go. All right. So I will talk to you later. Peace, love, and hair grease. Smooches.